Hello, this is Lord Og. Yes, it is, and welcome to some uh, Don't Starve Reign of Giants, which of course is the uh, DLC for the game. Now, I've had quite a few people ask me to play this, so finally, here it is. Um, <clears throat> basically, now you've got four seasons, you've got all the four seasons, you know, uh, spring, summer, autumn, winter, and that is basically what we're going to be playing. Everything's just about on default. The only thing I've changed is what I usually change, whereas I've increased uh, carrots on the floor because there's no fun in me just starving to death. And uh, that's about it. Oh, I think I've increased rocks a little bit. But that's because on one at work, on one on a couple of times I've played now, I've had a lot of trouble even finding gold. And that's just, where well, you can't build a science machine without it. So, you know, that's not an option. Okay, I'm going to start on autumn, and I'll tell you why very quickly, because winter, we know what winter does, it freezes you to death. Spring is harsh because it's raining all the time, which makes it quite hard to, uh, you can you can suffer from wetness, like uh, on that one, and that can make you freeze, even in winter. And, I mean, even in spring, if it's heavy rain, <laughs> heavy rain. And also, summer, which, to be honest with you, they've made incredibly nasty now, with the fact that you're overheating. Believe me, it's a lot harsher overheating than it is freezing. So, I've, I've experienced that a couple of times now. So, we're going to start on autumn, because autumn is kind of what summer is, because you can in summer on the sandbox game, uh, normal on the normal game, and... Um, Autumn is kind of closest to that now, so it's still got rabbits, it's quite nice, and uh, it kind of is in between. And what we'll use autumn is, autumn's going to lead on to winter, so I'm going to kind of make sure I've got some things in place for when winter comes, so I'll be nice and hot, nice and warm, and then of course while I'm playing winter, I'll make sure I've got some things ready to keep me cool for when that for, and all that kind of thing. So kind of one, one season will prepare for the next, if you know what I mean. So, let's get started. So, first of all, we're just going to... I want to just start, if you look. We're on, we're, we're on day one. I only just got in here. So, we're going to start doing what we usually do. Oh, hello, Mole. So, we'll start doing what we usually do. Uh, resources. This little crap burger here. He goes after... He goes after things like... Um, you know, things that are laid on floor. If they're just left on floor. Like flint and... Uh, you know, things like that. What's it called again? Yeah, Flint. It'll take that kind of thing, so you've got to be careful. So we're just basically getting ourselves established. I've got a swamp over here. And, uh... Oh, here we are. This is what we want. This is nice. Plenty of Flint on the get-go. That's nice. I can get an axe and pickaxe out of that. So we'll be good to go for rocks and wood. We ain't got to worry about either. Okay, so to answer a question that I actually got asked, and so I'm going to get out, so I'm going to answer it. Don't use answer it on other games, like, but unless I'm doing an actual Q and A. But I was asked, do I review games? I do review games if I have played them. I will not to uh, re. I will not review a game I haven't played because yes, I could read up on what another person's opinion of the of a game is. But to be honest with you, I am. If you don't know by now, I'm very opinionated. I have my own opinions. Very much so. And so I... Uh, I'll tell you. So I don't I, li I don't like to rely on what other people think of something. I like to make my own mind up. So I will review games that I've played if you really want me to. So if you want to re if you want to a review of a game I've actually played, then just let me know and I will review it and I'll be honest. You know, you know I'm going to be honest. So if it's terrible or I didn't like it or whatever, be prepared because I will tell you the honest truth. I don't preview games because of what I've just said. Because I know that games like Watch Dogs and that is coming out and I'm looking forward to them. But at the end of the day, you can always be disappointed in a game. And I don't like to be one of those that's te that, that is like going crazy about a game only to find that it sucks. And I don't, as I've said already, like using other people's opinions. So I don't preview games, no, but I will give a review if you ask. Oh, and finally, uh, I don't, no, I don't review music. 
I don't talk. I don't. I don't review music at all because I don't really have enough time to to listen to much music. So there's no point in me reviewing any. Okay, I'll just let you know that. And I did look at the link you sent me at that band, and uh, well, yeah, all right. They were <laughs> they were very um, raunchy, and yeah, and I did force myself. I was shocked at ra yeah, raunchiness, and I had I had to force myself to sit through the entirety of that video about 15 times <laughs> although I have got the bloody song stuck in my head now you know you are and I hate you because now it keeps playing in my head and it's driving me nuts I mean it wouldn't be so bad if I could understand the words but then again I have actually done that before I uh, I actually ended up really liking a complicer song and I actually uh, liked another one a while ago that were Spanish or something like that and I don't speak that either so I suppose it I, you know this doesn't matter but I do like to understand them usually but I suppose I can live with this one because uh, yeah the uh, the dancing definitely made up for not understanding the words <laughs> yeah. but now that song's stuck in my head I honestly when I heard it do that now but now it's bloody catchy and it's doing and it's really screwing me up now so if I, if I don't get out of my head, I'm going to come and bang you in the face. <laughs> I'm only kidding, I'm not. Okay. And I refuse to play the video any more times, because, well, my heart can't take it. <laughs> okay, so we're getting late, getting dark soon. Everything's coming along well. You've got to remember, for the first few nights, it's just going to be exactly what you expect it to be. Just going to be uh, picking up some resources. There's not going to be anything too major happen, hopefully, in the first few nights because we don't want to get carried away. You're actually probably safer chopping down these trees because if I remember right, I think it's three days you've got, three days respite you've got before um, before you're going to bump into a uh, before you'll really bump into a tree guard. I think it's three days, so you know you, you're kind of safer doing those, taking down those kind of trees. Okay. I don't need enough for a fire pit. Oh, we've got here, we've got a savannah. You know me, I love my savannas. How many oh I got I've got enough carrots. I do love my savannas. Especially if there's a especially if there's no beef well, I want plenty of um thingy. And plenty of rabbit holes, which there is. Look at these. Beautiful rabbit holes. Right, so I'm going to stop collecting grass for now, and I'm going to actually go for rocks if I can. I'd like to get... Yeah, I'd like to get 12 before night comes, but if it doesn't, I'll just put a campfire down. But it would be nice if I could find one more rock. Oh, hello, touchstone. Okay, they sound busy bees. Oh, why are these here? That usually means there's something, some special. Oh, pig village. Excellent. That's good. Oh, so that would make this even better. I'm going to have to drop a campfire down this time because I'm not going to have enough time to... Uh... Yeah. Not going to have enough time to get a fire pit. But I am going to come here. This is it. This is my baby. This is my spot. Actually, this is a really good advantage, this place. Because we've got rabbit holes close by we've got a pig village literally you know just down here got to be careful because we don't want to get uh, we're going to have to probably bring it, uh, it up here higher is that really long? <laughs> okay we're probably going to have to take it a bit further up because at the end of the day I don't want to be too close to the pig village in case they turn into were pigs at some point which we know they will do so it's better if I'm not too close I'm doing all right for carrots anyway. Okay, let's just arrange things how I like them. If I find what keeps going bidding in my room, I'm going to actually stamp on it. There's something that keeps giving a bloody chime thing, and I can't find it anywhere. Okay, what comes next? 
So we used to have them, then them, and then I usually have these. No, I usually have wood. I always have things in the same order. I don't know why. There we go. After that, I don't care. As long as I've got these five taken up like that, because these are my resources, so I also always have them here. So I have my grass, then my twigs, then my wood, then my flint, then my rocks, and then I usually just have anything with anything. If you're wondering why I'm actually collecting this stuff, this, this nitrous stuff, it's because... You can actually use that now. There is a... Oh, there's a thingy there as well. That's good. Yay. Okay. Fireflies I'm thinking of, by the way, just so you know. Um, there is a fire you can make for the summer. Where, so you don't overheat. And it's built... Uh, when you build it, to fuel it, instead of putting rocks, uh, logs on. I don't think you put logs on it. I think you put, but I know you can put that nitrous stuff on. So it actually gives it a purpose now, other than just being a pain in the tits. Because usually it is, it's usually no good. See, this is the kind of thing now, you see, you've got this dampness kind of rating now. And you'll get that in spring, and it'll really come into its own in spring. Well, now I've actually found a place I want to put my uh, camp down. I'm looking for some gold now, so I can get myself a uh, a science machine in place. Okay, so we've got enough. Um, let's just plant these. We'll plant them here. So I've got enough um, wood now, so let's just run around and see if we can find some. Oh, this savannah looks like it might go on quite a way. Or is this, is this all one savannah? Or is this a second one? Oh, let me get some more twigs. Twigs and grass I'm still collecting. Food I don't really need to now. Not for now anyway. Don't really need to collect uh, any more flint because I'll be collecting that as I uh, beat rocks up for now. Okay. So what do I think? Oh yeah, it's all one. Oh, I've got a toothy bottom. Here's this pig village. Okay. Let's go and open up the toothy bottom. <laughs> toothy bottom. I know actually some people on their playthroughs have actually took <laughs> to call him one of these a toothy bottom. Oh dear. Well, it looks like a bottom like that. It's got, it looks like it's bottom. And then when you get close by, it's got teeth. So it's called a toothy bottom. <laughs> Oh dear. Oh bugger humming that song. Tell you what you want slapping for sending me that song, you really do. Okay, so now we're gonna get some gold, finally. Got some more up there, so we'll take that as well. Some walls here, yay. Some more gold, we'll take that. I will go, all the gold, more gold better is, is, is how it is right now. I'll take these things as well because I'll get that nitrous now, which, like I said, is going to be useful. Problem is you can't leave it on the on the floor because them, them soddy moles come and steal it, basically. They'll take it if you put it on the floor, so really you need to get a chest down and put these things in there. And uh, we have our first thing. We have our box thing, so let's get that picked up. Thank you. And we have a gnome. I'm taking you with me. Oh, we've got a spear. Saves me having to make it. So why don't we now... Where's the... Oh, I always forget where the sodding backpack is. Oh, you can't do it. Idiot. I want to get one of these built first. Okay. Let's... Do this and then we'll go back and pick a place because it's starting to get towards darkness now. Or towards night time anyway. Oh, there's some good gold around here. This is what I like to see. Sod off you. See how it's coming towards me now, look. And I pick it up and it stops. But if, I, but if, you, if you put stuff on the floor, it'll turn towards you and start coming to take it. Okay, I've got enough for that now. So let's head back to... Um, oh, have I got rid of that? But yeah, I've gone through a couple of... I need to build some chests anyway. Okay. And we'll take down another couple of trees. 
before I actually get back, get to where my base is, because I'm going to need to build a chest. So I'm going to need to have a bit of wood left over. I know it's getting late, don't worry. I'm sorry I picked up Wilson if people didn't want him, but to be honest with you, I just come, well, kind of wanted to gain the game and I didn't want any really advantages or hindrances either way. Because that's what happens. You know, like some will give you advantages and some will give you, you know, some will give you hindrances. And I don't want that excuse that, oh, you know, it's because of this or because of this. You know, so basically I've took my, I've took that away by just picking the kind of middleman. And uh, we'll just see how I do with him. So like I said, the only time I'm really worried is about it's going to be summer. Because I've, I've experienced summer and it wasn't pretty. Wasn't pretty at all, summer. Okay, let's get back to there then and go and plant and go and get ourselves down. So it's just down here, past the toothy bottom. Have we got a road runs through? We have, because you know how I like to do. I like to be near a road so I can just jump on the road and run down. Do we like this? Is this the area? Yeah, because if you look, we've got like one, two, three, four, five there, and there's a couple more up here. So six, seven, and that's good. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to plant it round here. Usually I'll plant above, but it doesn't really matter. It makes no difference. So I'm going to, in fact, I will plant above because then I can put everything behind me. So we'll go here. I like that. That's a good place here. Nice and far enough away from the pig village. And boom, there we go. Well, now we now have something down. This is our base. So let's also build a, build a science machine. Get that down, not too close to the fire. Okay. Now we, we, we're doing well now. First thing we're going to make is a backpack, of course. That's going to give us a bit more room. Now we're going to look towards making a chest. So we're going to need some uh, planks. Boards. I call them planks, but they're boards. I think it's three, if I remember right. I know I got rid of all them, but I am carrying nine others, so it's okay. And that should let me make a chest, which is here. Is it? Is that chest? No, 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 it's that. That's right. Chest, good. Okay, so let's get a chest down here. Okay, let's get some things in the chest we don't need. So let's go you, uh, the thing, the gnome, you can go over here, uh, gold, you can go in, I don't need you exactly yet, uh, blah, blah, blah. that seems about right, okay, let's eat, oops, no, not that kind of eat, okay, let's eat, I must well eat these as well, because it doesn't really matter now. Okay, so we're looking towards getting, of course, some uh, things set up. Uh, some charcoal and that. I've got to think about a crock pot, because we're going to need food. So we've we'll got to think about that. And gain more resources, basically. I need to get some more trees cut down. So I'm going to run off, cut some more trees down, and then probably plant them a little bit closer. You know how I do. And... Uh, Good thing is, we've got the pig village just down south, so if hounds come, we've got that covered now. And if anything too bad comes, we can always jump in the toothy bottom that's just up north. This is actually a really good, actually good place for us. Okay, we're going to run out of axe in a minute, so I'm going to make another one of them. I'm going to make another pickaxe because we're after them too. I'll tell you what I have, what, what I should make. shovel because now of course I can dig up the stumps as well to get an extra over here now I can dig up the stumps get an extra log which is good and I'll knock this down no it's this one bloody hell get chopping I made you another one So there is actually a giant bear, bigger or something. It's like a, it's like a half bear, half um, badger. 
to call something like a burger. And uh, it seems like it's quite... Um, it, it doesn't aggro unless you actually really get close up in its face. Otherwise, it seems like it leaves you alone. Although, when it does charge, it seems like it's quite uh, nasty. So, that's not good. Pick, a f pick some more, a bit more food, because we're going to have to... How many... Uh, see, I've got enough here to get some... To get some uh, charcoal, enough charcoal to make a crock pot, so we're okay. And of course, over time, more trees will go down. So let's plant these trees, and then we'll call it a day there, I think. Uh, where are they? There. Because we're going to burn these down, actually, and uh, for, for some charcoal for a crock pot. I'm taking it, we still need that. It's been a while. Oh, missed one. I think I only need about six or something like that. But there's enough there, let me make sure. Yes, stay closed. Uh crop pot should be here somewhere, I think. There it is. Yeah, six charcoal. So that's what we're gonna go for. We'll get some more we'll get some more uh, stone as well. And then we'll get some, uh, then we'll burn these down, get some charcoal, and we'll make ourselves a crock pot, which will then give us better food. One more thing, let's have a look down here. So we can see where it takes us. Okay, so look how far away we are. Oh, we're not miles away, it's how, it can, it's how far it can take you. So let's go back through. Last thing before I go, I'm going to quickly visit the... What? Shut up. I'm going to quickly visit the pigs just to open that area up better because they're here and I just want to say hello. Should introduce myself. Hello, piggy. I knew there was something when I saw the uh, carrots information and that kind of thing. Okay, so it's not a bad size. It's not a bad size at all. Got some bushes here as well as all the. Um, carrots. Like I say, the only time you really need to worry about it is when they uh, turn into wear pigs. But you should be okay as long as you as long as I stay in my uh, my base and don't get too close. Do you know what I've, I haven't seen and I don't know why. I suppose there's a reason for it. I don't know. That's um, a pig king. I honestly haven't seen a pig king in a long long, long time. It's really weird. And yeah, it still gives you stuff. So I'm guessing it's still in game. It still gives you them little things you can dig up from graveyard, graveyards and that. So I don't know. I really don't know. Okay. So I'm gonna go. So yeah, that, oh, there you go. All those are asked. I've got you've got what you wanted. You wanted some. Uh, you wanted me to play some Reign of Giants, and uh, now I've started. It's going to be interesting to see which way it goes. And, uh, yeah, I look forward to meeting some of these giants and you know, having a bit of fun with them and seeing what they what they can do. I haven't actually uh, met any yet. And I haven't even been in, uh, you know, I haven't even had the little console open and, you know, and seen what and seen what it's like, what they like and put them in game and how to play with them. Uh, I did with Earclops, I admit, I actually put him in game with the little console on a, on a spare save I'd got and actually had to play with him to work out fighting weaknesses and things like that but I haven't I haven't with any of the giants of this so it could be fun anyway guys thanks for watching hope you've enjoyed the first episode and we'll watch that video again <laughs> I'll, not. I'll see you next time you take real good care of yourselves okay because I want you to <laughs> I'll see you next time bye for now